My name is Masahiko Murakami from Skeleton Crew Studio. We are based in Kyoto. We are making uh, VR content and AR content and also like an indie game. I also run an indie game event called Bit Summit in Kyoto. We like a Japanese indie scene is still really like a small and we are like a kind of like a started like a few years ago. Uh, of course, like a, you know, your country or like a North America or Europe indie scene is really really big. So we are trying to catch up uh, with you guys. But uh, since we have like a lot of unique styles, so maybe some of you know like a uh, you know Japanese indie game. So I uh, hope we have like a bigger market or bigger community. Like soon. Our company is like a special for like a VR game. Uh, so we started uh, like a three years ago to make like the first like a PlayStation VR content. As I say, like uh, I run an indie game event in Japan, Kyoto, uh, called Bit Summit. So we still struggle to you know create the bigger community or you know like an ecosystem uh, with the indie scene in Japan. So I heard like uh, in Montreal or in Quebec, you guys have like a really big uh, indie community. Uh, something like a La Guild. So I want to meet like uh, people who are actually in a community or uh, I want to meet the people who run the indie community here uh, and discuss like uh, how we can like adapt your like culture into you know like a Japanese game industry and also like uh, in the future I want to collaborate uh, with like you know the like, Kyoto or like a uh, Japan uh, between like Japan to Canada or Japan to like Quebec or Montreal. So so, so I'm looking for the uh, partner to work together to create like a good like a Japanese indie scene. Uh, so I met the guy who ran the uh, La Guild. I, I met the guy who ran the like a Pixel Challenge. Uh, so I met the like, Japanese person who actually bridged like a you know Montreal cult animation culture to Japanese animation culture. So uh, <laughs> listen to you know what they did. Listen to what they are doing. I, I, I'm sure like I could like you know um, collaborate with them and you know make like some bridge between like a. Montreal indie scene and Japanese indie scene. Probably like uh, we have like a, I think I think we have like a good environment and good culture. However, maybe we don't have like a kind of like a sharing, you know, feeling between like, J Japanese people is really better, you know, kind of like share your feeling or share your like, you know, uh, knowledge to the people. So um, I want to create somehow the environment that people can easily like communicate together. I mean, help each other, I think. Maybe the first challenge to me is like, uh, get people's trust because maybe like people think like I'm doing that for the business or you know like a, something for me but it's not like I want to create that kind of environment for the people uh, who's actually in the indie scene and if I create that it's good for me too because I'm also like indie developer and a creator so today like I talk with you know, guy who run the Pixel Challenge. He wants Japanese team to come to you know his event, the Pixel Challenge, right? So if we start doing that, if we start sending people to the uh, from Japan, and if we like uh, invite people from Montreal or Canada. So then like I think they start like you know doing something you know each uh, different place right so I, I hope like uh, someday like maybe this next year or you know two week, two years from now uh, some Japanese people started like company or some like you're living here to do some um, like indie development Be because like I heard like uh, Quebec and Kyoto has like a uh, you know, some kind of partnership between now. So I think with that, like maybe it's possible. Okay, so in Kyoto, every spring, we are having like an event, it's called Bit Summit. So if you like a, like an indie game developer in Canada or Montreal or Quebec, it's interesting coming to Japan, like please contact us or like, uh, you know, contact to this channel and like maybe please come to like our event. Thank you for watching this video. 
feel free to reach out at any time and make sure to tag somebody in the comment section if you think they should watch this video. VFX Lifestyle.